Welcome to Clowning Around the Issues. Tonight we have four very important guests. Hi there. I'm Frosty the... Not yet Popsicle. First we have Congressman Ron Paul. Thank you Mr. Clown. Give it up for Congresswoman Michelle Bachman. Thank you, I'm really happy to be here. And finally, former President George Bush Jr. Thank you. I'm happier than a cat that killed a whole mess of canaries and ain't no one done a thing about it. <laughs> you are a good man, George. Did you just ask if you could sit on my lap, Michelle? Let's talk about issues. Ron Paul word on the street is you hate education. No. I want teachers, parents, and local community leaders to make decisions about education, not Washington bureaucrats. My plan will see more Americans get a higher quality education with more freedom to choose. I see you want anarchy, Dr. Paul. Libertarianism is not anarchy. You worry that if we remove the chain around our necks we will run amok with no self-control, compassion, or consequences? Hey Mr. Clown, can I weigh in on this? Of course Mr. Bush. Dr. Paul, deep down inside, people are just bad, except you good Christian Republican voters out there. <laughs> so we got to be real careful about letting people make their own deciding about stuff or they could keep their kids out of our fine public school system. I was learned in that system and I turned out real good, see? Yes. I must agree with George about our fine public school systems. With the exception of all the gays, minorities, and atheists refusing to conform. Thanks, Michelle. That dress works well with your eyes. Thank you, Bozo. Hey, Doc. I got a question for you. You've got all those brown-skinned, towel heads who hate freedom and McDonald's looking over here with greedy eyes while working away at building weapons of mass construction. Destruction? Yeah. Wanting our destruction. So if we don't hit them before the hitches, how you figure to protect America? The hate you describe comes from us killing their people. I don't think Americans would be too happy with foreign soldiers wandering our streets with guns. We are the invaders. Right now we have a choice to stay or leave. Which do you think leads to more fighting? Yo Dr. Paul let's keep it positive. Any comments, Frosty? I was talking to President Obama yesterday. He's my friend. I have an idea for a new bill and he likes the idea and said he would help me get it pushed through. Get it out. Popsicle. Snowmen make terrible workers because we are really sensitive to temperature and you may not know this but we are pretty much constantly urinating. I wondered about that smell. You. So when companies hire us, our salaries suffer because of our disabilities, but these disabilities are not our fault. You want a law passed to make sure you are paid the same as your co-workers? Yes. We are being discriminated against. I wish you luck with that, Popsicle. Time for a commercial break. I will dance for everyone during the break.